Hey everyone, welcome back to Low Call News Guyana. We've got some breaking news from Guyana that you don't want to miss. Law enforcement officials just made a massive bust, destroying over $560 million in cannabis. Let's dive into the story. Police conducted eradication exercises across Wiruni, Burbis River, and Kaiwa, Upper Burbis River area, from 3 a.m. to 4.05 p.m. on Saturday. In a single day, they obliterated two major cannabis farms and a nursery, saving the streets from an incredible amount of illegal drugs. Let's start with Wiruni. Police found two farms with a massive amount of dried cannabis and plants. On the first farm, officers uncovered 1,200 pounds of dried cannabis, valued at an astounding $489 million. And on the second farm, a 10-acre area was packed with 150,000 plants worth around $50 million. Both farms were completely destroyed by fire. Moving over to Kaiwa, officers discovered two more cannabis farms in a large camp with even more illicit drugs. The first farm covered five acres and had around 1,000 seedlings planted on some beds, along with a nursery containing approximately 35,000 seedlings. Meanwhile, the camp held around 34 kilograms of dried cannabis valued at a staggering $30,617 million. And just 100 feet away, officers found another farm with 2,000 plants ranging from 8 inches to 4 feet tall. These plants weighed in at 2,200 kilograms and were valued at $338,800. Just like in Wiruni, all farms, the nursery, and the camp were destroyed. Surprisingly, no one was arrested during the operation. Wow, talk about a major operation. These eradication exercises are a huge step toward keeping the community safe from the dangers of illegal drugs. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below.